Does your knee collapse in like this when you step back into a lunge? If so, yeah, this is not really great for your knee joint. And I'm all about knee health, uh, joint health. So I want to show you this exercise to have you put the right pressure in the right areas in the right ligaments of your knee. So we're going to work in a little high lunge today. And I want to welcome you here with me. As we step back into this, we're going into a high lunge without momentum. That means we go slow and we don't kerplunk into that back leg or in the joints. You know that kerplunk, we've all done it, um, me included. So I want you to pull your thigh bone in and focus on the outside of your hip, the outside of your knee, and the outside of your ankle. And we're gonna do an, a little energetic press into those three areas that I just tapped on. And let's say the lines that would connect them. And let me show you what we do with the foot. The pinky toe reaches out and you're able to put a little pressure through the outside of the foot and ankle. This is gonna help uh, with the energy flow through the outside line of your leg and all the way up into your hip. And we're gonna hold here for a while. So you can do whatever you like with your arms. You can bring them up, you can put them behind your head. You can, who knows what you're doing up there. Maybe dance a little bit. But here's the front view. You see that where the knee is, it's not collapsing in. I want you to hold that pressure. And we're holding it for over a minute, well over a minute, so that you gain this strength and energy running through there. Now, when we step forward, we're gonna bend our knees and then lift up. Beautiful. Ta-da. All right, I want you to just feel what that feels like in this leg now. <laughs> Just notice, come back into it and check. Let's step onto that second side. All right, same thing, hip, knee, ankle, outward press right into that energy line. Yep, and you can do whatever you like here with your arms. Here's here are a couple um hips shimmy <laughs> who knows but we're staying here and really the focus is on this lower body activation getting everything aligned right and energy flowing through this outside line of the leg a lot of times you know from how we sit and maneuver we're not mm, pressurizing through and energizing through this outside line you can you saw I just kind of went down a little bit if you want to make it a little bit more challenging for your thigh you can also pull your thigh bone in toward the hip socket come into that chair pose as you lift up and just notice how your knees feel here and over time this practice is going to build your energy so keep it up and stay tuned for more until I see you next, take really good care.